So scientists at the Kenya Medical Research Institute in Kisumu are racing against time to find out whether malaria is a risk factor for severe COVID-19 infection. This comes in the wake of increased COVID-19 cases reported in the lakeside counties. As Mashirima Kapombe reports, the 18-month study will be critical in how COVID-19 cases are managed in malaria endemic regions. The lakeside counties of Kisumu and Siaya have in the past week recorded a rising number of COVID-19 cases. Scientists at the Kemri Center for Global Health Research in Kisumu are keen to find out whether malaria is a risk factor for severe COVID-19. When the COVID pandemic started and all the data coming in in the early, in the early part of the pandemic really highlighted the risk groups. It said if you're hypertensive, if you're diabetic, if you're overweight, if you have other pre-existing conditions, then you'd be at risk of not only COVID infection but also severe COVID-19 disease. What we didn't have answered at that particular question, especially in us who live in malaria endemic areas here in Western Kenya where we work, is we didn't know how COVID and malaria would interact. The 18-month Malkov study began in January this year. The first patient, also malaria endemic, were on a steady rise last week. Between Tuesday and Saturday, Kisumu had 330 cases out of the national tally of 1,942 positive cases, while Siaya accounted for 245. But the numbers recorded Sunday and Monday show a drastic decline. What's interesting is we are seeing COVID occurring in a malaria endemic zone where patients normally come with fever, tiredness, um, so malaise, tiredness of body, um, headache, basically symptoms that look quite similar to COVID-19. So when a patient first presents in the hospital, we just used to test for malaria, but now testing for COVID, for both COVID and malaria, because we can't really quite distinguish. The only thing that COVID has over malaria is the respiratory symptoms. The results of the Malkov study expected mid next year will give medics in those regions direction on how to better manage COVID-19 where malaria is prevalent. Mashirima Kapombe, Citizen TV.